you little rat bastard. Hello? What the fuck? His name is Agazira. What's going on Godzilla Nation? This is our Godzilla and today the anthology continues. The uh, Dark Pictures anthology that is. We are diving into House of Ashes. It, it, it's up there. House of Ashes. I'm so keen to finally dive into this. After seeing the teaser in Little Hope for this game, it really hyped me up. And for those of you who have been hanging around on my channel for a while, you know how much I love these kind of choose your own adventure, the choices matter kind of games. Until Dawn has forever been one of my favorite video games to play, Man of Medan came out to kick out the anthology and kind of fell a little bit short in, in my eyes. Everyone has their own opinion. Little Hope came out then and absolutely smashed it out of the park. So House of Ashes, I have high hopes for. I'm not going to set the bar too high, though. I don't want to get upset if it falls short of the mark, but uh, fingers crossed we have a very solid experience here. Now, I have made an active decision to do something different, something we've never done before with these types of games. We are still playing alone, even though I love the concept of doing multiplayer for these games. But what we're really going to do here is we are going to do the lethal difficulty and as you can see on the screen over there, death is inevitable. So we normally try to keep everybody alive from start to finish with these games. But this is really going to test our skill. This is really going to push our limits. Everybody could die off early. This could be the shortest series I've ever done on the channel. So uh, let's dive on in. For they have sown the wind, and they shall reap the whirlwind. Jose 8-7. Every choice has a consequence. Okay, we're kicking it off like until dawn. Some decisions save lives. Others lead to death. And I can promise you, there's going to be plenty of death. I, I, I can assure you of that. Choose wisely. What's going on here? Oh, hang on. Oh, okay. Okay, we've got some beheading straight up out the gate. A card, 2231 BC. Nothing to lose your head over, mate. <laughs> Get it? No! I don't want to die! Silence! Your words are meaningless here. Your blood will pay the debt our king demands. Your sacrifice will lift his curse from our land. General Bellato, forgive me, my lord. The king demands your urgent presence. Save by the bell. The gods smile on you. For now. Take this one back to his cell. I'll deal with him later. You're in luck, Gutian. You're one luck? lucky son of a bitch. No. No luck for these dogs. General, we should leave this place. The king, his madness threatens to swallow us all. This temple is cursed. I'd rather die in this cursed house than perish to the plague and famine out there. We have our orders, Captain. Love the beard bling he's got going on. The moon god sent you to destroy my kingdom. I know it, girl. I see everything. Look around you. It's a pretty dope mask. Not famous enough for my mistakes. Do the gods not bask in its glory? The Gutians are coming, General. The Moon God sends an army to destroy us. I shall muster our forces immediately. Good. 
and what news from below? There are hundreds of prisoners, my king. Their sacrifice will take time. Time is no longer in our hands. No matter. The blood of this army will nourish the sands. The sacrifice will be fulfilled. Sacrifice to what? Starting with this one. <laughs> Tell me, General. Does she remind you of anyone? My king? Do you not see a hint of your own daughter in her? What age would she have been now? Eighteen. Eighteen. Hmm. What a tragedy this plague has been. Don't bring up his daughter as he's about kill to kill her. someone. Reluctant should we keep her alive, compliant by your command. I feel this guy would follow his king's orders, so we're going to go with compliant. By your command. <laughs> Got to be quick on these buttons with this difficulty, it looks like. Oh, good old This Is Sparta down the stairs. Nice. She gonna make a run for it? Oh, we're gonna yeet the spear! Night, bitch. Yeet! Golly! The king seems pleased. Still feels a little bit wrong that uh, he's killed that girl after the king brought up his own daughter. But by the sounds of things, he used past tense, so he had a daughter, but the daughter's now dead. <gasps> and this bitch has been beheaded. Here you go, my king. Little present for you. That's for all you bloodthirsty bastards at home. I told you there'd be plenty of blood spilt. Oh, we might have a little prison escape here. Gonna choke the bastard out. Good night. Incompetent guards. Well, we've had two deaths in the space of a minute, so uh, we're off to a flyer. What's wrong, my liege? They're ready for war. Clips, I think. Okay, there's definitely something down there that 
I think that's what these sacrifices are being made to. We've got some underground creatures running around the place. Gods give me strength. All the king's dead. Don't ask me how the fuck that happened. He was alive a second ago. Ooh, something's picking those bastards off real quick. start a fight. Piss off, mate. He builds this temple to call for forgiveness, but the gods don't listen. And now he too is silent. My king, free of his madness now, as are we all. Free, free to die. This is your temple. What can we do? There is a way out through the catacombs. You think I should trust you? I don't think you have a choice, man. I have no choice. I've heard it. Let's get on down. Did you notice as well that updated our relationship with this guy and it went down after he noticed the king was dead? Maybe if we had chosen to not kill that girl and go against the king's orders it would have improved our relationship? That's the beauty of these games. There's so much replayability. Follow me. There is a way out through the storm. Don't? Yes. For the builders when they're done. Come. There's something big around there. Don't move. Oh, yes. Uh oh. You little rat bastard. An Acadian? Scared of a rodent? I have seen it all now. How many men died for our king? I thought I was the hitting it in time. Nothing. Turns out I was wrong. Oh, you little bastard. Here we go. Find the secret exit. got here. Well, 
We've unlocked our first premonition. Here, help me with this. I didn't think that was going to open. You first. We're safe down here. You first. What is this that adorns you? Nothing to concern an Akkadian. How do we get out of here alive? We help each other or arrogant worry about your own hide. Be respectful. The enemy of my enemy is a friend. We help each other. It's all about survival, ladies and gentlemen. There is always hope. The king's now dead, so we can afford to, uh... What was that? Have some liberties. How many ways into this tomb? We're not alone down here. Over here. Hello? What the fuck? Huh? Oh, you got a hammer hard. You've got a hammer hard. No escape. Our only hope is to stand together. No! If we both run, then we both die. Ready your sword. We're gonna fight. Oh, we could have betrayed him. Now we're fighting. We're fighting. We're fighting. We're doing the honorable thing here. Oh shit! That QTE happened so quick! Good night. So much blood. That bearing has been updated. Wow. I wonder whether there would have been a chance for them to successfully get out of there. Won't you spare me over till I feel betrayal would have been good because we could have kept our guy alive. Starring Ashley Tisdale. This sequence with the curator and the rendition of this song.
compass. I wonder what that uh, woman crossing the road is all about. That guy on fire. Is this all for this current game, or are we looking at more kind of hints you towards the future? On the edge of an abyss. <laughs> Your survival depends on the choices you make. They will be as a compass guiding you through the unknown. Will you find the path to salvation or be lost in the darkness forever? Let me speak plainly. You're about to make some difficult decisions. Oh, I bet. Decisions that will affect the lives of others. How those decisions play out will become clear over time. I expect you're wondering who I am and where you are. I am the curator, the custodian of tales. My purpose is to keep a record of everything you do, every decision or mistake you make. This is my repository. It is filled with untold stories. Stories about friends and enemies. Loyalty and betrayal. Life. And death. Understand See, there's a, there's a fourth book already up on the shelf. Help you. Although... See, the two that are side by side, and then there was House of Ashes, and there's one angled. To descend into the unknown alone is extremely brave. Or extremely foolish. Perhaps there is more to you than meets the eye. Let me give you a few words of advice. Oh, please do. Throughout the story, you will encounter certain pictures. Pictures which allude to possible outcomes. I suggest you pay attention to their meaning. They could foreshadow a future best avoided. But alas, the sands of time have run out for us. We'll meet again soon to see how you fare. Or fail. Iraq, 2003. Actually, you know what? You know what? I, I have to... I have to satisfy my curiosity right here. Let's, um... Let's rewind a little bit. I really want to see how that scenario would have played out if we had chosen to betray that guy instead of fight with him. Ready your sword. Yeah, ready your sword. And I'm gonna run away. I well, good yet. Trail at its best. Did old mate forget there was a... <laughs> I kind of prefer that ending. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That just shows how, you know, the slightest little change in direction just takes you on a completely different path. And that outcome there, holy shit. I hope you guys are keen to follow this story. I'm dead set. Oh, it's hooked me already. I'm, uh... I'm already vastly more impressed with this than I was with Man of Medan the first time I played it. And 
this for me is probably on the same level as Little Hope compared to how Little Hope started off as well. So if you guys did enjoy the first episode and are keen to see more, do myself a favor and hit that like button down below. If you're new to the channel, you can hit that red subscribe button as well. Hang around for more content. I'd appreciate it if you did. I will be running a playlist in the description. So with future episodes, if you want to catch up and all that jazz. But that, it's not there. It's not there now because it's the first episode. But you'll find social media links down in the description. Feel free to follow me on those. And make sure you've got notifications enabled by hitting that bell icon down that way. So when I do upload... You guys get a little ring-a-ding-ding that says, Hey, Godzilla just put something up on the YouTube. You should go check it out. But that's it from me, guys. I'm out of here. And as always, I will catch you guys next time.